This is a transparent blue that I made out of an opaque blue and I just mixed the opaque blue with clear. cleaned off the tacky layer and now I'm just going to shape up the nail into more of a pipe nail shape. I will be showing you how I apply my gel sea foam and I will soon be having an upcoming video on how you can make this. I'm just going to apply a little bit of gel around the smile line. It's a very fine white matte glitter and I'm just going to put it on where I have the uncured gel. And then I'm going to cure it in the lamp for um, probably a minute and then I'll brush off the excess. You will be seeing me apply little acrylic pieces that I made out of my mold here. And these acrylic pieces are very thin and that way they'll lay flat down on the nail and they'll be easy to encapsulate. And I'm going to be gluing these pieces on. Do like part of a starfish right here. You don't have to use all of it. I want to file it, all of it, and just Take your scissors and clip some of it off. Same here. And then you can file it. I'm gonna come in with my small liner brush and I'm going to add some more of the transparent blue. And then I will cure this in the lamp for three minutes. I'm just gonna take a very little tiny bit of the gel, uh, the transparent blue gel and just wipe just a tiny little bit over top of the white acrylic pieces. Don't want to like lose the look of these pieces inside the nail. You want them to still be visible. You want it to be like a muted effect. Kind of like they're they're underwater, you know, in the deep blue ocean. I'm going to go ahead and cure this in the lamp for three minutes and come back and add more gel as needed. I think it might need just a little bit more gel right in here and that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to add some there. Here is the nail after it has been capped and cured and I cleaned it. Now I'm going to be filming how I file and shape this nail, only that segment will not be included in this video. It will be in its own upcoming video.